hey guys welcome back to my channel it's marisa in today's video we're going to be doing a bb craft project share so let's get started with the project share Hey guys, so here are the molds and here are some of the things that I made, all the beautiful colors. Look at these huge molds and these beautiful pendants. This is already unmolded. I used some beautiful white mica and this copper flake. It is gorgeous and I am absolutely loving it. Look at it through the light. So beautiful and it's pretty heavy, so... Here are these smaller molds right there. So yeah, we are going to do some unmolding of the rest of the silicone molds today. And all the links will be down below. So here are some things that I did use uh, on top of the molds. And there is the smaller kit. So let's get to unmolding. Okay guys, so first I just want to show you what I used besides, you know, the molds is some of this Arteza uh, mica pigments. These are actually a little bit less pigmented than my Primal Flow and that's actually what I wanted. So I got this beautiful green moss color, this lettuce green, some white goldy um, mica as well and this beautiful like lavender purple that's really beautiful uh, that's why i like the arteza because sometimes you don't want it so pigmented i also finally tried some of my nouveau products in my resin as well it's not just good for paper crafting it's not just good for paint pouring it is actually great in resin as well so we got that copper flake there and these beautiful red hexagons that i'm really going to be using a lot for christmas stuff and here are the flower petals um like i showed you in my unboxing video and i'll link it right here whoops so those are those beautiful power uh, flower petal beads and they worked really well in these resin projects. So in the link down below, you can use my code webpaint 5 and you can save $5 off a $40 purchase, okay? The links to that will be in the description below. All right, so here is that first huge, a <laughs> huge pendant. I don't know who would wear this, but I really love it because you could do so much with it. You could do beach scenes. You can make like um, geode colors, the lavender. You could put so much inside of that. That's why I got them. And here is like a jade color uh, round pendant as well. My son actually loves that one. You see that little glitter there, that purple reflect. And there is the little lobster claw that actually came with a smaller kit. And here is this that lettuce green with some beautiful glitter in it. It actually became concave. Probably my table wasn't balanced, but I actually liked the way it came out. And this one doesn't have a hole, so I just wrapped it around on the top there and I really love the way that came out as well. You see how sheer that mica is? And so you could see through it. That's why I wanted that. And here's a smaller one right there with some beautiful white mica pigments and some of the green glitter in the side. And then on the side there, I actually um, use some Nouveau Gold Mousse and I just used my finger and, you know, dabbed it on. So one of the tools I used was this little kind of nail file to file down the edges of the uh, finished um, resin art. And this is a hand drill and you can use it to put a hole through. Now these already had holes already, but I need to make some of them a little bigger so the cord would go through. So that's a little hand drill I got off of Amazon. So let's move this to the side. And let's unmold the rest of them. All right. And, they, uh, and there's that little 
flower petal in there. It fit perfectly in that heart mold, and I wanted I used I wanted to see if it actually would fit in the smaller molds, and it did. And these come out so easily. Look at how easy they come out. They just pop right out, which I kind of knew it would. And look how pretty that jade one is. Got the white mica with the beautiful um, Tonic Studios, the mermaid um, glitter. And that's a little pink glitter there. And that purple mica. Just adorable. Yeah, and I just love these because they just easily pop out and I have to say the BB craft molds really usually work beautifully and I did not say it but thank you BB craft for sponsoring another video thank you so much here's that lettuce green these are a little plainer because not everyone wants tons of glitter or you know items in there so that's just a plain purple one and that is just me playing around with a very clear, just a little tint of color. And the same thing with that green one. Just like a tint of color. I love it. It's very, very happy. All right. So here's the second part to the set. I can't wait to unmold that one. That's more of like a Christmassy theme to it. You know, the holidays are here, guys. So here's that white pigment and then those red hexagons that work perfectly. It's like a little peppermint feel to it. A little candy cane. And I could actually embellish these with some of my Nouveau products, which I love. So there you go. These molds are really working well. They're actually nice and shiny, so I love that. And I love the fact they have all different shapes. It's not just repetitive of the same shape over and over again. Each mold has a different shape. So that's really cool. And here are some just plain white ones that I could embellish later if I want. Or use some pretty, you know, different color cords. So that is that one. Okay, I'm excited. Let's unmold these bigger guys. All right, so they are nice and shiny, a little shinier than the other ones. And that beautiful pink glitter. And I'm really loving the fact I could use my Nouveau products in literally everything I do. And I really love the way this came out. I love that one. It really looks like a jade, like a fake jade, obviously, but and a little mermaid sparkle got caught in there but that's okay because you know glitter gets everywhere and this is more like mermaid inspired look how beautiful uh the shift is to that glitter those beautiful mermaid stars and i love this one as well i put some crushed glass in here white uh, mica pigment and the purple and it just looks like a little geode beautiful I just love these molds. They work so very well. And you can make, you know, three of each. And I think that's awesome. I'm just taking a little piece of resin right off the bottom there. Once it gets hard, just peels right off. So let's unmold the last two of the huge molds here. So let's do this one. You just have to pop it out. And it's pretty easy to pop out. Look at that. So simple. And look at that. I just love the dimension it has. It just worked beautifully, and I think someone would really, really love this. And I cannot wait to put cords through them all. These colors, these molds are just, they just worked every, uh, absolutely beautifully together, and I have so many ideas on what to make with them. And here, that's what I really wanted to do, use those beautiful um, flower petals in there. And this beautiful white mica, and it just pooled perfectly. I just love it. I am really loving these, and I'm so happy I got them, because I have so many ideas. Beach scenes, and I have shells, and all kinds of wonderful stuff. So yeah, that's it guys. So that is one set. And there is the other set right there. 
And so, you know, all the links to all the products will be in the description below. And please don't forget about their YouTube program. If you have a YouTube channel with 100 subscribers or more, you can apply for their YouTube program, make videos, and receive products. So that's it, guys. All the links are my affiliate links. Also, I have a code, WetPaint5, where you can save $5 on a $40 purchase. So all the links to their website, um, to the website, to the YouTube program, and my affiliate links, and my code will be in the description below. I know it's a lot, guys, but I just want to if you'd have all the information thank you so much for watching today i hope you love these molds and these projects that i made i'll be using them again don't forget about these cute little flower petals and thank you so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you never miss one of my videos and i will see you in the next one bye